We are going to add a band camp and bed block on our Squarespace website and make sure it's responsive for all page sizes. So first we want to go ahead and get the embed code. I went to the Stillhouse Junkies band camp page. They're my sister's band. I highly recommend you check them out on Google. Under every single band camp album and single is a share and embed code. So we're going to click on this and click on embed this track. You can choose from three different sizes. The information we're going to go over today is going to work on all three. We're going to pick this block for now. If you want to change the colors, you can. For now, you can leave all of the rest of this as is. I'm going to go ahead and click in here and do Command C on my Mac to copy. And we're going to come back over to Squarespace. I'm going to click on Edit, scroll down. I'm going to hit the G key so I can see my grid. We're going to go ahead and add an embed block. Now, you can use a code block, but it requires a business plan or higher, and the embed block works great. So I'm going to go ahead and put this code in. We're going to go to Code Snippet, Embed Data, and I'm going to go ahead and do Command V to paste that. Now we're going to pretend that this video is multiple videos. I want to go ahead and put several of these on the page so that we can mock up a layout that might be similar to something that you would put on your website. So let's say we have three different band camp embeds. I want to show you what happens if we don't take this additional step. So I'm going to go ahead and hit save and exit. And as I exit out of editing mode, the screen size is going to become smaller. And this might be equivalent to a tablet or if someone was viewing this on a very small laptop. You can see these are overlapping. So I want to show you how to make sure this looks good on all screen sizes and on mobile. So we're going to go ahead and click edit. And we're going to come back into these embed blocks. I'm going to click the edit button on the embed block. And basically, we're going to come back to our code. Bandcamp, when you export this iframe content, it says keep it at 350 pixels. It gives a specific width, which is great, except it doesn't work on all screen sizes. So instead, we're going to say we're going to take 350 pixels, and instead we're going to say 100%. And what we're telling the computer is that instead of always keeping it at 350 pixels, make it 100% of whatever this frame is. So I'm going to go ahead and do this on the rest of these. So we're just going to click Edit, and we're going to replace this with 100, and I'm just clicking off the screen to exit. So, so far it looks the same on my screen, but when I exit out of here and size down, you're going to see a difference. So, we're going to save that, and we're going to exit. And now, when we scroll down on a smaller screen size, you'll see these fit perfectly. However, I want to show you one more thing. This looks good on a super small screen size, on mobile, and on a medium screen size. However, on a large screen size, we need to take this one step further. So if we were on a larger screen size, you'll see some of this information down here at the bottom starts to get cut off. So the way we can fix that is we actually can make the height a little bit bigger. And I'm going to go with 500 pixels, and you'll see that brought back some of that information. Now, the height isn't as big of a deal in the sense that you can always scroll. So I'm not worried about this on mobile or other screen sizes, but we want to make sure that on, on larger screens, all of this is showing. All right, and we'll go ahead and hit Save. And then we'll double check it on the rest of the screens. So I'm going to hit Exit. I'm actually going to come back to my normal screen size and you'll see on a small device it still looks good on a bigger screen it still looks good if I was viewing this on a very large display and then we of course need to check mobile so we're gonna click this little mobile icon and here we go it looks fantastic on mobile as well 